The sun sets near Anzaldúas Park. Constables look to see what's happening in Mexico. Constable Larry Gallardo says his men have been very busy lately. We had almost 150 just this week alone. We're told the Mexican military is now patrolling their side of the border, but only until the sun goes down. When the sun sets... One, two, three, four. Here they come. The action begins. Photojournalist Andrew Sanchez and I followed a constable as he walked closer to the river. Once we reached a higher point... Yep, got him. We noticed a group of people who just crossed the border. And they only speak Portuguese. She's going to California. California, oh, miss. She looks uh, pregnant? She? Yes, she's 15 yeah. years old. 15 years old. Eight months pregnant. Constable Gallardo says they're seeing more people trying to cross into the U.S. Uh, you have more family units, more small children, uh, more more mothers and fathers that are trying to get across and uh, trying to seek a better way of life. We came across another group who just made their way into the U.S. Are you relieved that you're here now? I can't believe it. I'm here. <laughs> this wasn't the last group making their way across the border tonight. There's more coming. Constable Gallardo explains why their role on the border is so important. If they're not picked up here along the border, then they run a risk of being taken and put in stash houses. Once Border Patrol picks up the group of 21, the constables return to their post. They now wait for the next group to make their move.